What's going on everybody and welcome back to a new episode of GBA. In this video we're opening up the December Mario's Mystery Block. Uh, so yeah, I'm a little bit late opening up this box. Uh, I had COVID and I was out of commission for a while. Um, so definitely late getting this out, but I hope you guys still enjoy it. Um, so yeah, this is December 2021 box. Uh, so for those of you that don't know, Mario's Mystery Block is a Nintendo themed mystery box that gets sent to your house once a month. Um, the uh, title is a little bit misleading because this isn't necessarily a Mario box. It's literally a Nintendo box. You can get stuff from any franchise. They do have theme boxes that are like specific to a character or a gaming franchise. Um, but still, it's a Nintendo box. So if you guys like Nintendo, like me, this could be the box for you. Uh, so this box costs right around $30. I think the price did go up a little bit. This box has been a little hit or miss over the last six months or so. Um... If you go back and watch my videos from a year, year and a half ago, this box was fantastic. Loved it every single month. Here lately, it's been lacking a little bit, especially in the quality of items they're sending, but I still love this box, uh, primarily because I'm a big Nintendo fan. So that's what I'm saying. If you guys like Nintendo, this could be for you, and it's not overly expensive. Uh, so let's go ahead and let's open up this December Mario's Mystery Block and let's see what we got. I think their November box was kind of themed along Christmas, so I'm kind of hoping this one isn't, but it might be too, and I might just be mistaken, who knows. <clears throat> so once we cut that tape and we pull this open and see, let's see what's inside. Um, first up, we usually have our card that tells us what this box is. So wishing you a happy, a very happy new year. Press start and uh, 2022, so that's kind of neat. <clears throat> so I'm guessing it is not Christmas themed. Uh, on the back of this card, it just says unlock the mystery block. It's basically telling you to hashtag your unboxings or pictures, you know, anything that you post to any form of social media. All right, so with that out of the way, let's go ahead and let's see what we've got. I usually love the t-shirts in this box. They are exclusive to the box. And that's what we have up first is a t-shirt. Looks like it's black, so that's amazing. I will show you guys the primary design first. Is it cool? Let's see what we've got. So Winter Games. So this is pretty freaking awesome. Uh, so it's a Mario and Bowser themed uh, Winter Games t-shirt. It's kind of the same artwork style as the uh, Winter Games game on the NES, if I remember correctly. I just really like the style of the shirt. I like the colors. It's really, really cool. I love this. So you will probably be seeing me wear this in a video in the near future. But yeah, definitely a strong way to start. All right, so next up, what is this? We have something that I don't know what this is. Uh, it looks like it's like one of those things that goes on a graduation cap, which obviously was long, long ago for me. Um, I'm about ready to turn 40, so this is definitely something that I will not use. And I don't honestly, I don't know if anybody could even put this on their cap for a graduation. I'm not sure. It's probably just for, you know, a little trinket thing. It is Zelda. This is not that. This is a keychain. Yeah, it's a keychain. But it looks like that thing that goes on a graduation cap. Tell me I'm wrong. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but it's really, really cool. Especially if you like Zelda. Um, like I said, I don't really have use for keychains. But it's still pretty neat. And it's not bad. Uh, it's officially licensed, so that's really cool. Alright, next up, we have one of these little uh, World of Nintendo figures, and it's Mario. Um, they've been sending us quite a few of these. I think I have three or four of them, to be honest with you. The good thing is, they're never the same Mario. He always has a different pose, so I can deal with that. And I love little vinyl figures. I know they can be kind of silly, and they take up space, but I like them. Uh, so I have no problem getting these guys. So that is really cool. And we've got one more thing in the box. So I'll show you guys first. It looks like it is an Amiibo. 
All right, so we actually have a Yarn Yoshi, and this is the pink one. Um, I don't have this one, I think. Honestly, I think I have the blue one and the green one. So again, the pink one is pretty stinking cool. Uh, I think they actually sent me the blue and green one, to be honest with you. So now I have a pink one. So this is amazing. I absolutely love the Yarn Yoshi Amiibos. I'd like to have one of the big ones, but those things are really expensive now. But yeah, this is a great way to uh, finish out this box. And I love that. So that's it. Nothing else in our Mario's Mystery Block. Uh, so yeah, now that we've pulled the stuff out, let's do some pricing and recap. Let's see what kind of value we got and compare that to what we paid out. When you're getting mystery boxes, you always want to get a little bit of extra value compared to what you spend. Uh, so let's go ahead and let's get this started. So we have the awesome Yarn Yoshi Amiibo. Uh, I don't really collect Amiibos, but I guess I do because I got about 15 of them. I just don't buy them for myself. Like literally every single Amiibo I've gotten has came out of this box. So we'll give this $15. That might sound a little bit high, and it might be, but I think these yarn amiibos like this are pretty sought after. So 15, we'll give this little vinyl figure, I don't know, like six bucks. So it takes us to 21. This keychain that looks kind of like the thing that hangs off a graduation cap. Uh, let's go ahead and give this, I don't know, six. So we're up to, what is that, 27 or right around there. Shirt, we'll give $15. So let's just say 27 and 10 is 37 and 5 is 42. So if we pay 30 to $35 for this box and we get $42 in extra value. That is a plus. Um, and honestly, this is one of my favorite boxes I've gotten from them in quite some time. Uh, the other way I grade these boxes is do I like the stuff they sent us? T shirt is fantastic. Amiibo is great. And the vinyl figure is, uh, you know, staying in my collection. This I will keep, but I don't really have a use for it. So this box easily gets an A-plus grade for me. Uh, like I said, it's probably one of the better boxes I've gotten from them over the last six months. Um, let me know what you guys thought about this box in the comments. Did you feel like this stuff was worth about $30 to $35? Um, did you like it? What was your favorite thing? I would love to have a little conversation with you guys about the Mario's Mystery Block. But that's probably going to do it. But first, I want to say thank you. I appreciate you guys. If you know somebody that might like this kind of content, share the video. But for now, I'm probably going to go open up some more boxes, maybe play some video games, try to enjoy the rest of my evening. Hope you do too. So until next time, everyone, I'll see you later.